I actually started work when I was 17, so I couldn't work outside, and I started as a draftsman. And Leonard Day, who was the employment office supervisor at the district level at that time, said to me when I was leaving the office, said, don't forget, kid, when you get to be 55 years of age, you can walk with your pension, health care, all of your benefits. So that looked pretty good to me. So I didn't bother doing too much interviewing, even though I knew electricians, carpenters, and the rest of them had much more money than we did. But the thoughts of someday raising a family and getting those benefits were very important to me. Right. There was no gift uh, in return for getting these benefits. That was part of my total compensation. I worked in salary administration and management job evaluation and knew and understood enough that in order to get these benefits, you gave up something, and that basically was part of your salary. So it was all total comp, and nothing was being given to us. We were paying the price to lower salaries than comparative to other people out in the crafts. It worries me a great deal, especially at our age now. I mean, when we were younger, we didn't have those kinds of uh, problems. But uh, as we get older, we have, you know, a lot of medical problems that come up. And so it's very important for me that we keep those benefits because I don't believe people our age could really afford the, 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 uh, the monies that it costs now to, to take care of your, your health problems. So, you know, it's, it's, it's an amazing, I mean, we're so grateful and so uh, lucky to have all of these benefits. Hopefully, we'll be able to keep them. And we hope all the senior citizens that have it and have worked for it all those years will be able to keep their benefits. <laughs>